A pre-dawn wave of marked and unmarked law enforcement vehicles descended on the Palacio apartment complex just a few miles away from the San Antonio airport. It's about 4.45 a.m. We're on the corner of Sahira and San Pedro. Uh, they're about to start hitting the apartments. A lot of activity going on right now, and they should start hitting the apartments at any second. There you go, flashbangs. And with that, Operation Aurora was underway. The operation marks a significant development in an ongoing crackdown on the Venezuelan transnational organization Tren de Aragua that has been operating in San Antonio for months, according to the San Antonio Police Department. More than 150 SAPD, Texas's Department of Public Safety, Homeland Security Investigations, state and federal agents helped in the sweeping of hundreds of vacant apartments allegedly being used by Tren de Aragua. We had reports of TDA being involved with criminal activity in this area and uh, we clear ended up clearing about 296 vacant apartments. This undercover SAPD lieutenant explained this operation stems from intelligence gathered by undercover officers for months. Sources tell us some of that information was developed within the San Antonio Migrant Resource Center. With the proximity to the border, TDA has been on your radar long before national news covered it, right? Yes, ma'am. We've been, we've been working on this uh, for quite a while now. From this spot, just a block from the apartments, we were able to hear and see for three hours the movement of law enforcement as they found those who were using empty apartments allegedly to commit their crimes. Crimes which we are told include prostitution, distribution of cocaine, and human trafficking. In all, 19 people were charged, according to the chief of police. We've confirmed that four TDA members are in custody. Trend de Agua members are in custody. One TDA member is a confirmed enforcer for that gang. As the sun came up and officers finished, we were able to drive into the complex. As you can see behind me, these are some of the empty apartments that the police department cleared this morning. In total, there are 900 apartments in this complex. We're told by federal law enforcement sources that most of the apartments are housing migrants. We're also told that janitors and those who work here fear for their safety and that of other migrants who have nothing to do with the Venezuelan prison gang. In San Antonio, Texas, I'm Jamie Virgen reporting.